In 1905, a hunting lodge called The Towers was completed on Dark Island in the Thousand Islands. Inspired by a castle in a book called Woodstock, Frederick Bourne, the fifth president of Singer Sewing Machines, built his hunting lodge complete with secret passageways and a dungeon. During the castle's construction, Bourne never revealed to his family exactly what he was building on the island. He told them only that he was building a hunting lodge. When he finally brought his family to the islands to see his creation, the family was astonished at the sight of the five-story, 28-room English castle rising atop one of the islands. One of the unique opportunities about Singer Castle is the Royal Suite, which guests can rent out for an overnight stay and truly experience the wonders of the castle. Weddings are also popular on the island. Upon Frederick Bourne's death, his daughter Marjorie Bourne owned the castle. A few years after her death, the castle was sold to the Harold Martin Evangelistic Association from Quebec, Canada. In 2002, a group called Dark Island Tours purchased the castle and renamed it Singer Castle. On August 2, 2003, after massive restoration, stabilization, and cleaning efforts, the castle was opened once again to the public for tours during late spring, summer, and early fall. Several tour boat companies from Alexandria Bay, Morristown, and even Canada operate tour boats that stop at the castle. And with over 600 feet of dockage, the castle also welcomes private boaters. Today, thousands of visitors enjoy the castle that was one remarkable man's summer vacation home.